Greetings, here we are inside Flash CS5 and today we're going to be making title selections for a video file such as a MOV, MP4, FLV uh, in a Flash document. To start off, create a new Action Script 3 document and save it by going File Save or Control S and save it to the same folder as you have your video file in. Next we're going to go to that video um, file uh, slash folder and drag and drop it into this stage. Select the first op two options on your computer, load external video with playback component, hit next. Select a skin for your video, I've chosen skin over play seek mute dot swift. Hit next and as a final note if you're uploading this to a web server or something you have to make sure that the swift file is in the same place as your video file such as the, as the mov or mp4 as the video isn't actually embedded in the in the file, it's just referencing it. So you, they've got to be in the same location. Uh, here's my video um, video file. It's or video. It's very very small. So I'm just going to increase it. It's so small for um, demonstration purposes. Uh, just give it an instance name of vid player and press Control Enter to test it. As you can see, it's working, which is good. Next, we're going to make our title selection button. So just click the rectangle, select a color, draw it, uh, select the whole thing with the arrow tool. Go, oh, hit to F8 or go modify, convert to symbol. Call your button TS1 for title select one. Ensure export for action script is checked. Hit OK, OK, and also give the button an instance name of title1. Uh, I'm just going to edit the button a bit. I'm going to press F6 three times to give it an over, down and hits. It's going to change color and over, down. I'm also going to make a new layer and remove the last frame on that layer and put some text on the layer called title one. Go back into the main uh, timeline and hit control enter. You can see that the video is still working, the button is still working except it's not doing anything so the rest is going to be handled by our action script. Just save that and go to the video description, copy, and copy the code in there. Um, go to your actions uh, window by going window actions or hitting F9 and paste it in as so. Uh, ensure you rename illidance underscore one dot flv to the whatever you've named your video file and seek to 10. Um, that's the time in seconds that it's going to skip to when you click the button. So close that and hit control enter. And as you can see, the video is working, and when you click the button, it skips to that particular point in the video. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. I'm Cyflix, over and out.